Are you super into riffing but you can't quite reproduce a clean and fast riff? Today's exercise will show you how you can perfectly replicate every single riff by breaking it down and releasing tension in your throat. For more fun exercises like this one, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell to get notified every time I post a new video. Today's exercise is based on the song Rise Up by Andra Day. All right, let's have a look at how the exercise goes. breaking down the riff. You want to give each note a number so you can clearly hear and then replicate every note. This is exactly the same thing but now on the actual word move. Make sure you're still not skipping any notes. One, two, three, one, two, three. Make sure you're really supporting right here for that top note so you're not going flat. Make sure you're really accurately jumping up and down so your pitch is great. Instead of giving the notes numbers, you can also give them syllables like la or na. I like la because it helps you to still relax your neck, your jaw, and your tongue, and keep your mouth open wide as well. Rise up, rise up, rise up. So now the actual words, so make sure you're really supporting from down here to get to that top note up there, and so we can hear every single note clearly and individually. Switching back and forth between the two vowel sounds e and e in the word day helps you to break up the riff a little bit more. This is a trick used by many, many singers out there. Make sure you add a little bit of vibrato at the end of a fray to make it fancy. A thousand times again, again, again. Careful on those ascending riffs. You want to keep all the notes separate there. All right, let's do the exercise. We'll start slow and we'll gradually get faster. All right, prepare yourself right here. Take in a good breath before you start. One, two, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh. One, two. Here. One, two, three, one, two, 
support. Oh, one and two, three, one and two, three, one and two, three, one and one, two, three, four, five. La 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 a syllable or a number or whatever works best for you. Slow down the recording so you can really hear each individual note if that's something that helps you. I do it all the time. Number two, start out slow and only get faster once I feel comfortable at that tempo. And number three, once you can do it at the actual tempo on the syllable or the number, do it on the word now or the sound that the singer is using. You are most likely going to have to slow it down again, okay? So same process, just slowly build up, but only once you're comfortable with that tempo. If you'd like more exercises just like this one that help you get better at riffing, check the description box below. I have six exercises that I put together for you uh, that help you improve your riffing. Also, if you want to join a community of female singers just like you, be sure to join our brand new Facebook group. It is amazing in there and I put up little challenges for you that you can participate and you even get to win some prizes if you participate in those challenges. Check out these videos next to help you improve your singing voice and don't forget to like this video if you thought this exercise was helpful and share this exercise with your friends who you think could benefit from it. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.